All right, so we're back here in the Arbitrum ecosystem, and today we're going to be taking a look at NFT marketplaces. So we can see there's plenty of different marketplaces. The two that I'm familiar with are this Stratos marketplace and also OpenSea. So we'll take a look at both of those um, marketplaces today on Arbitrum. So first we'll look at OpenSea on Arbitrum. OpenSea, most people are probably familiar with, is the most popular NFT marketplace. We can go up here and we can click um, rankings to see a list of um, NFTs. We can click Arbitrum to um, see all of the NFTs which are on Arbitrum. We can see the Arbitrum Odyssey is um, the most popular NFT here some speculation about the airdrop most likely fueling that. We also have um, the government toucans, um, which is a cool NFT collection. And then this uh, six anniversary NFT. So I'm just gonna go ahead and um, purchase an NFT for show and click all time to get the most traded Arbitrum NFT. We've got the GMX Blueberry Club NFT. Now I'm going to go over here and I'm going to click floor price. And we are going to do the cheapest NFT just to illustrate the point. Um, so some of these cheaper NFTs, um, if you just click on this one right here, for example, and it's probably just a scam, but yeah, definitely a a scam but we now have this in my cart so I can click on my cart and um, I can just click complete purchase click on MetaMask sign the transaction in MetaMask then we will be rewarded with that NFT so let's say I want to go over here and use Stratos I believe that's how it's pronounced I can click connect wallet MetaMask. The process is very similar. Click in MetaMask here, connect. And here's some of the different um, NFTs we can purchase. I'm going to click on this six anniversary NFT. Um, I think some of these are kind of cool. I'm going to go ahead and uh, just take this one right here just for show. Um, click purchase NFT. And in MetaMask, I'll be able to approve this over here. Scroll down and click Confirm. So now, um, if we go to My NFTs, we will go ahead and see that very fast. We can go over here as well and click on Profile. OpenSea is a little slower than Stratos. I can scroll down, we can see this NFT. My Coinbase NFT um, hasn't gone through. I guess I forgot to approve that. So we'll go ahead and approve that right now click confirm and that should pop up in here shortly once that transaction is settled all right so we can see that transaction was settled and we now have both of my Arbitrum NFTs here um, and if I did want to go ahead and sell them I could go ahead and sell this one right here I can simply click sell and I can click for price 0 0.00068 um, just to undercut the floor price by by a bit and click complete listing and we can go ahead and click confirm this is a security thing. And sign. Go ahead and click can view the listing right here. All right, to go ahead and sell our NFT on Stratos, we can go to Stratos right here. Click connect. We can go down, click on this NFT, sell NFT. And then we can click the price we want to sell it for. Um, let's say we can want to sell it for that. 
You can click the duration. I'll just click six months. And we'll go over here to the right and approve this. MetaMask is just giving us that security warning again. We can now see that this NFT is listed at our price of $11, though it will probably never get filled. And we can click back here to see our NFTs. So thank you guys for watching. That was how to use Arbitrum, Stratos, Marketplace, and OpenSea to go ahead and buy and purchase NFTs.